What's up, y'all? Got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We about to get into WAC 100 on Blueface. Four-year prison sentence. He'll be home in nine to ten months. I also want y'all to know today is my birthday. Now, it is an excuse for me to be lit. All right, so I am. Yes, I am. Y'all, uh, you know, if you'd like to wish me happy birthday, thank you. I'm a Leo, thoroughbred, all right? And uh, I'm in a great place right now. Let's get into it. What's up, Wag 100? What's up, what's up, what's up with you? All right, so we just left out of court. Uh, yeah. The judge decided to violate Blueface's probation. Yeah. And right. said it, people are saying he's going to have to do the full four years in prison. Right. Can you break it down to us? He got four years, 400 some days off. Come down to three years. He go to state and do third time. He'll be home in nine, ten months. All right. Thank That's you so it. much, Wack. All right, what's up, Wack 100? We're going to listen to that one more time. What's up, what's up with you? All right, so we just left out of court. Uh, yeah. The judge decided to violate Blueface's probation. Yeah. And right. said it, people are saying he's going to have to do the full four years in prison. Right. Can you break it down to us? He got four years, 400 some days off. Come down to three years, he go to state and do third time. he be home in nine, 10 months. All right, thank That's you so it. much, Wack. Right. Wack. All right, so Wack 100 said that Blueface is going to do um nine to ten months now something about and i could be wrong but i know with the la county jail it, they're full so if your sentence is 100 days you're gonna do 50 right uh but he's going to the prison so i'm not necessarily sure of how many you know if he gonna actually do all those years also though we about to react to um Cassandra, because she broke down everything going on in this in this situation. So we definitely going to react to that. So I'll have more information for y'all. So let's just go ahead and do that. Welcome to Legal Doc Talk 24-7. It's your girl, your favorite paralegal, a.k.a. Cassandra Lynn. And I missed you guys. Uh, so today, um, thanks. A shout out to the subscribers for messaging me and let me know the updates um, regarding Krishan and Blueface. It is very much appreciated. Um, but I did want to come on here and um, talk about the latest news with Blueface. Um, so let's hop right on into it. Uh, if you have seen probably now on various platforms uh, and social media that Blueface um, is supposedly had been scheduled to four years prison time uh, for the probation violation um, in California. Uh, so kind of to speed everything up to give you guys a general idea everybody knows that back in 2021 and I'll flip this to make this bigger. So back in 2021, he was um, arrested for an assault uh, against a bouncer at a uh, nightclub in San Fernandino. Fernando, I keep saying it cor <laughs> correctly, uh, but I think it is San Fernandino. That's where my friend live at. He assaulted a, a bouncer, or bodyguard, whatever the case may be, and he was convicted of. And that's another situation I didn't even know about. Um, that charge. He pled nola contendere. We all know what that means. It's not saying that you did or you didn't do it, but you are accepting whatever uh, plea that comes with that. Um, and then going into, let's see, he had a hearing again for the probation violation sentencing today. Uh, we know that it was pushed back uh, because I believe that the judge was going through some things, but you know, obviously, we know. I, in my personal opinion, I don't think it was so much of her um, having surgery or anything. It was just merely the fact that they had to kind of go back and forth. And um, and when I say they, the judge, the defense attorney, and the state, you know, trying to come to some type of agreement to see exactly what. Um, you know, how they were going to handle the situation. So initially he was sentenced to um, a formal probation, which carried, um, well, I'm going to take that back. It was a formal probation. And the judge said, okay, I'm going to put you on probation for two years and five months. Um, and, you know, during that time, you have specific stipulations and rules that you have to abide by. You know, you can't violate your probation in any way. 
And so we know time and time again, even if we go through the proceedings, if you look how many probation violation hearings that he has had in the past. All right. So California is saying enough is enough. Um, but I do want to point out something. If you're not familiar with uh, the, what for uh, formal probation is, it's very important that you understand probation in each state and the terms um, and the sentences that comes with that particular probation. Okay. Uh, so going here, it says a formal probation is granted by the court and as an alternative to prison. For Appreciate the uh, ten dollars uh, sincerely. Formal probation provides an offender with the benefit of supervision in the community by a probation officer. Offenders are given court-ordered terms and conditions of probation to follow for three to five years. If the offender violates those terms and conditions, the court will be notified and they could be sentenced to serve the remainder of their sentence in county or state prison. So first of all, it's very important that everybody understands that there are different types of probation. Like here, you have a summary probation, all right? So he was placed under a formal uh, probation. Now, as far as what the sentencing is for what he violated, which was penal code 245A. And I'm going to go here. If we look at this, um, any person who commits an assault upon the person of another by any means of force likely to produce great bodily injury shall be punished by imprisonment in the state prison for two, three, or four years. Or and this is this is fighting the security guard. This don't even have nothing to do with Krishan and that girl situation. So <laughs> is he going to have to serve time for that? And then when the blue face fight a security guard, I don't even remember that. I don't remember that. They're in the county jail for not exceeding one year. Oh, they or beat up that security guard. They jumped the security guard and beat him up. By a fine not exceeding $10,000 or by both fine and imprisonment. OK, so here they initially they granted him a formal probation. OK, and at, like I showed you we guys to the club with Jaden, got it. There were several probation violation hearings that took place since he was sentenced. So now that you violated your probation, um, your formal probation now based off of what we see here, you have to carry out your terms. So for that, like I said, it's either two, three, or four years. So supposedly the judge said, okay, your, proba your probation is going to remain revoked, and now you're going to be sentenced to four years in prison. And that's that. So I, I showed you guys the definition of what formal probation is. I showed you guys what the penal code is and the sentence that it carries. Hopefully this, um, you know, kind of sums up why he was sentenced to that four years. All at the end of the day, it is going to be up to the judges. Basically, <coughs> he was sentenced to, sentenced to that um, formal probation. I think she's saying formal probation. So since he put pause on somebody, he had to do that full time. Um, of that sentence discretion that she could have sentenced him to two years she could have sentenced him to uh three years but she thought four years would be sufficient now all of this is alleged uh, we don't know exactly if the you know if the court has done this i don't have the paperwork yet uh, but based off of uh you know what carlissa has been saying and uh, supposedly um blue's father he has been sentenced okay it sucks. It really does. I do not wish prison time, jail time on anybody. But at the end of the day, if you violated your terms of your probation, and this goes for Kashan and any of the criminal uh, uh, clients that I even work with, if you do the crime, you have to do the time. You know, there are so many chances that a judge is going to give you if they keep seeing you back in the courtroom 
they have to make an example out of somebody. It's Literally. very unfortunate, but here we are today. So tell me what you guys think about in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Until then, I'm out. Be blessed. Literally. Um. So that makes sense. I hope that makes sense for some of y'all in general. Um. But yeah, girl, that's it's just a lot. But ultimately, Blueface did a lot of pawn. He was putting hands on a lot of people. And then with his gang. <laughs> uh, I wish he would have just left them to do that, you know. Um, and I wish nobody had to get paws put on them in general. But damn it. Here we are. <clears throat> y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I hope this cleared a little bit up for y'all. If not, I, I tried my best. Listen. Um, that's all I got. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.